When I move that, that staircase, do you know what, what happens? I see that wall better. <coughs> so it automatically. But the thing is, timing, I have to get down and ready to go. All right? But everybody talks about getting up here and then trying to load up and then you're done. I, I mean, I didn't mean that so harshly. No, no. I mean, because you I hear this. Agree. You hear this. Yeah. I get to this position, I see the ball better. Yeah. Now, when we talk about also moving the balance is where our head is. Everybody gets to stand up again. Okay? Now, when you start understanding how incredible our mind is and our bodies, it's really, it's earth It's just incredible. So, all I want you to do is we're going to take our head and do it like this. Now, identify all the muscles that just fired. And I mean, everybody goes hamstrings. Okay, can you feel your Achilles tendons? Can you feel your lats? Can you feel your traps? Can you feel your quads actually activating? Can you feel the muscles around your knees? Right? Now, come back up. What happened? They all just turned off, right? The minute our brain senses any bit of imbalance, it puts on the emergency flag because it thinks it's going to fall over. It doesn't matter that I tell my brain, and we've been together a long time, I'm not falling over. Nope, it doesn't believe me. The minute the brain comes off balance, it starts firing muscles. You cannot stop it. You cannot stop it. So, the minute your brain is affected in any movement, what's it going to be doing? Compensating immediately. You don't have any choice. So if a hitter loses his <coughs> posture here, posture being you know, two-part, loses head posture, muscles start firing uh, right away. And if those muscles are firing to stabilize the head from falling over, are my rest of my movements going to be impacted or clean? I've got muscles fighting against each other. Okay? Remember we felt all those muscles that so if I'm making a move here and I'm trying to hit, what's gonna happen? My body's first in a dog fight with itself. I'm trying to do something, I've got muscles already fired. Muscles don't fire and then go back. Muscles don't work that way. But then suddenly you turn around and you realize, okay. But then importantly, something else happens. When that's happening, my brain is no longer really focused on the job at hand. It's more concerned about falling over. Guess what happens to my vision? <coughs> it shifts. I lose it. Yeah. it. It affects my vision. So I might see the ball good here, but if I'm off balance, it's going to be lessened from the point of my clarity. So that's we talk a lot about pitch recognition and being able to see balls and realize anybody stays back does not see a ball well. And I will guarantee you, I have taken 12, 14 year major league players, taken back shits out, put them in this position, and the first thing I'm Dougie man, I see the ball. I've never seen the ball like this. Honest to God. Wow. What a difference. You can take 10 year old kids, yeah, definitely college players. Hmm? Yeah. Any age of kids. Any, yeah. Wow, it's I see it better. It's huge. So, for all the guys that talk about all these moves and all that stuff, if they don't understand that I need to see the ball better, and that puts my mind at ease if I see something better. Why wouldn't I? <laughs>